All right, what's up, you guys? It's Shader Gamer back with another video, back with another banger. Look, you guys, hit the subscribe button, join the Shade Team today. If you haven't joined the Shade Team yet, then what are you doing? Because on this channel, I cover the latest news for multiverses. And you guys, good news, Iron Giant is back. I gotta say, I'm pretty happy that he's back in the game because it's always good just to have every character in the game. You never want a character removed from the game. If y'all did not know, Iron Giant was actually removed from the game. Well, an update came out today and Multiverse dropped some patch notes. I'm gonna have the link to the patch notes in the description. Some characters got nerfed, some characters got buffed, but Iron Giant was the main thing that we had to focus on being back in the game. And the thing about it, he may still be broke. <laughs> all right so y'all let me show you what i'm talking about so one of the things that multiverses went out their way to address when it came to the game is the fact that it had loops in the game characters had infinites and all like that to where basically they could just keep attacking you and you there was nothing you could do about it you just stuck all you could do is just watch them destroy you in the game well iron giant could still possibly be like that Oh, shout out to Noisy Boy for posting this on Twitter. I seen this. I'm like, oh, bro, man. I hope I do not run to Iron Giant no time soon. They doing something like this. Yeah, posted a clip from Mirror Man, which Mirror Man is a multiverses pro. He posted a clip of Iron Giant doing basically a zero to death, and it was crazy because I said, okay, you know, wait, we might still need to get this fixed. But you guys, this is the clip right here. I got it playing on the screen. Hey, look, I'm just put to you like this. Multiverses, I, I did not expect for them to fix everything with this first patch, not at all. And I hope nobody expected that either because still got some things they still got to add into the game. And like, you know, we don't want them to like just go ahead and just rush to try to get everything in the game because that can cause the game to crash, you know. They're going to have to implement some things slow and I understand, I get it. That, you know, some people have a problem with the fact that some things should have been in the game at launch. I get that. But they had already addressed that. They went from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. So it kind of like changed a few things or whatever that they had to go ahead and just add back into the game at a later time, which they are working on. I did a video talking about that as well on my channel where they address all the issues with the game and they plan on fixing it. You know, I guess take that for what it's worth. You know, some people will be happy with that information. Some people won't be, but I'm sure they're going to go ahead. They're going to get this straightened out. Or Mayor Mirror Man, just that cool. He was able to figure out how to do the <laughs> zero to death and all like that and just you know most iron giant players won't be able to pull that off i don't know i know i've seen a few people do that and post it on twitter but you guys i want you to do me a favor i want you to comment down below and let me know how do you feel about iron giant being back in the game are you happy with the patches that came out today comment down below and let me know i really want to hear your opinion but thank you guys for watching make sure you like comment share the video and also subscribe and join the shade team join the shade team thank you guys for watching shout out to the shade team as always and i'm out